My name is Antonio Lepore. My name is uh, Carmen Lepore. I'm his brother. <laughs> when I started with the Kions, I was uh, nearly 16, not quite 16. And uh, I started on the Roma Park here. And there was an old paddock with a um, horse and uh, cow and olive trees. It was in January 1960, anyway. So I started in 1979 and I started at South Parkland. And uh, yeah, after that, I don't know, about 10 years, uh, we've done a Japanese garden and I loved it, what I was doing. And, and now I'm still here. Uh, when I started here, I worked one year and a year and a half to create the park, plant it trees and everything, and then they move on on the Victoria Square. When I go to Victoria Square, it was uh, four people, you know, and you have a little shed, it was too small. Sometimes in winter time, it was very cold, and uh, we, we, I took uh, from home a kerosene heater. The old days used to be more work, like uh, breaking leaves, and this day we've got machines, and a lot of things changed over the years. And yeah, the old days used to be harder than what today, really. We had the, um, Japanese gardener, we did the like Australian way, uh, like all the rocks laying down. But Mr. Kamada and uh, Mr. Kamada Jr. came over. I think we spent about um, three, four weeks and they had the uh, dig up all the rocks, standing them up, which is like a Japanese way, you know, and that was really interesting. At the end, they were happy and I hope it still lasts for another 100 years like that. The Lepore brothers are two true gentlemen. They come in to work every single day with a massive smile on their face. Their biggest contribution to council is their, probably their commitment and their passion. They give 100% every day of the week. I work here like I work at home, you know, I, I'm, I'm, I try all the time to improve things. People work with me to teach them how to do it easy, to planting, to digging, to everything we do, you know. I. I've known the Lepore brothers since 1993 when I first started working at council and um, I've been in awe of them ever since. They're um, amazing gardeners, they know a lot about what they're doing. Their contribution to the parklands and the city of Adelaide um, is their longevity, um, the knowledge that they've passed on to other horticulturalists, um, gardeners, the plants they've planted, the trees they've planted, the people they've taught. Um, yeah. It's amazing what they've done for the city. first met Charlie when I came to the council as a trainee and I was put down at the Japanese garden and that's where I met Charlie and he took me on board and showed me lots of old pruning techniques and really how to look after a Japanese garden. I think we planted, I don't know, I would say about a million trees. Because years ago, like you said, it changed the, the parklands. There were no many trees those days. If I start thinking about it, we have done a lot him anyway, not me. I don't want to do the whole of the bobcat. He used to fill him in. So yeah. it really was a hard for him. Rain or shine, we used to do it. We improved a lot, more trees. We planted a lot, a lot of trees all around. The flower bed and uh, plant the box all around the city. It's all, all beautiful. And everybody appreciates. I was going to retire, but he changed my mind. Because um, at 65, I thought that was enough. Well, they put me work with my brother. He said, ah, give it a go. So, yeah. so we spent almost five years together like, laughing, talking about the old days. We always just sit on the same tables. We do share things between my brother. If he hasn't got nothing, I'll give it to him. He always got more than me anyway. <laughs> so the horticulture department at the city of Adelaide um, could see on the horizon that the Lepore brothers were coming up for the 60th and 40th for a combined hundred years of horticulture in the parklands and we thought that was worth commemorating. The garden that's being planted in Tony and Charlie's honour is a fantastic initiative by the council. It's a great way to really commemorate all the hard work that they've put in over the years. I am very pleased with what the council's doing for us, matter of fact, and yeah, we're gonna have a little garden there. I've been talking to my grandkids. Yeah, I've got seven grandkids, matter of fact, and they, yeah, when I told them about it, and yeah, they all jump up and down. They don't believe it. Between him and I, we reach 100 years in the council. I don't think either of the Lepore brothers will ever retire. Um, I can see them working here forever. Tony and Charlie are never going to retire. They love coming to work way too much. I want to establish my garden up there. When the garden 
establish maybe a, a retire. Me, I'm going to try and catch up. He's, I mean, he's working the council. So, I don't know, I hope I get another 20 years. My work, I love it. I love it, you know, because I'm, I love it to work with the um, Gyeongju. What he's saying is really, if you retire, sit down at home, come to work, it's more enjoyable. If you work, it keeps your life, I suppose. But if you sit down, you probably think about when you're going to die. Now I better come to work. <laughs>